Hello, 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 and welcome to the first broadcast of a brand new season of the Cat's Eye News, which we're calling CEN this year. We have a brand new team of journalists ready to get started. On today's broadcast, hate, homecoming, and haggis from Scotland. All this and more. Keep watching. Cue the intro. Next week is homecoming, and here's the schedule. This Sunday will be hallway decorating from 12 to 3 p.m. in the Old Wing. Pizza will be provided, and the more people that show up, the better your class's hallway will be. Student Council will also be working after school today in room 192 to prepare decorations for Sunday. They will be there until 4.30. Monday is Scrabble Day, so make sure to get a letter taped onto your shirt at the atrium. It's also the first day that homecoming dance tickets will be sold, and Student Council will have a table during all lunches. You can also buy a ticket online using this QR code. Tuesday is Celebrity vs. Paparazzi Day, and Student Council will still be selling tickets during lunch and online. Wednesday Spirit Day will be based off your grade's movie theme, and it's also the last day to buy homecoming dance tickets. Thursday is Class Color Day, so make sure to wear your class's assigned color. It's also the Senior Tailgate, so seniors during your lunch head out the main 10-mile entrance for pizza, cookies, and time with your senior classmates. Friday is the biggest day of the week. On Friday, classes will be shortened due to the pep rally at 1.45 p.m. where we'll see fun games, competitions, performances from Novi Cheer and Palm, as well as the student staff dance. On Friday from 5 to 6 will be the homecoming parade. If you're in an organization that is in the parade, please be at Parkview Elementary School by 445. If you're not in the parade, we'd love to see you lining the sides of Taft Road to show your support to Novi organizations. That night at 7 is the varsity homecoming football game against the Salem Rocks. The Cat Pack theme is green and white, which is also our spirit day for that day. Good luck, Wildcats. To finish off the week, Saturday is the day of the homecoming dance, and you cannot bring people from other schools or bags. However, you do need a student ID and no, knowing your student ID number does not count. There will be water, snacks, and a digital photo booth. That was a lot of information, but don't worry if you didn't catch it all. On Monday in your advisory, you talked about the homecoming schedule, and this is the QR code to that slideshow for more information. Also, make sure to follow the Novi Stuco Instagram for more information on spirit days and other things like that. Have a great week, Wildcats. Hey Novi, come join us on October 13th from 1 to 4 p.m. for Japanese Festival. We're going to be having kendo, martial arts, and authentic Japanese food for you. What's up Wildcats? I'm here to tell you about an exciting new opportunity here at Novi High School. Spring break 2026, current juniors, sophomores, and freshmen will all have the opportunity to go to England and Scotland with our new English program trip. You'll get to explore places around Edinburgh, Yorkshire, and London, amongst other things. There's an informational meeting on Tuesday, September 24th, after school at 7 p.m. in room 249. Whether or not you're able to make it to the informational meeting, scan this QR code here if you're interested in going on the trip. Hey Wildcats, I'm going to be doing some study tips on Instagram, so go follow the Cat Time News Instagram and be ready because I'll be helping you study. Hey Noai, our first TED meeting is going to be on Monday, September 23rd, after school at the Forum. What's up, Novi? My name is Matthew. My name is Ruse. And we will be covering professional sports. On Wednesdays, we will be covering Detroit sports teams in their past and upcoming games. And on Fridays, we'll be predicting NFL Sunday games. Stay tuned for sports coverage. Hey everyone, this is Melissa, and I will be reporting on Get to Know Our Staff. Our first staff member is Miss Shurig, so let's get to know her. Hey everyone, this is Melissa and I'm, today I'm with Miss Shurig. Hey Miss Shurig, how are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. Um, what subjects do you teach? I teach choir. Cool. Um, what's your unpopular opinion? Um, bananas are the worst fruit ever. They're disgusting. And pumpkin spice tastes like eating potpourri. It's awful. Cool, thank you so much. What's up Wildcats? My name is Yasin. I'm Chase. My name is Camden. 
And I'm Christian. And we'll be covering Novi Sports this year on Cat's Eye News. Tonight at 7, Novi Football takes on Brighton at Brighton. Be there to cheer on your Wildcats wearing red, white, and blue as the theme is USA. Also on Saturday, your boys varsity tennis team has a quad match at home and the girls cross country team will be running in Jackson. Hi, my name is Vanessa McHale and your Novi girls swim and dive team won Invitational making us the three time defending champion and I won junior of the meet. Hello, I'm Melissa, one of the new Catside News journalists this year. On Tuesday, September 10, some members of the GSA, the BSA, and Awkward Pause attended the My, Hate, My Response to Hate Conference hosted by the Michigan Department of Civil Rights. This year's theme for the conference was an allyship. We rise together against hate. Between a complimentary breakfast and lunch, we had the opportunity to listen to program directors, chairs, U.S. attorneys from the Eastern and Western Districts of Michigan, as well as Attorney General Dana Nessel. Students were also able to attend workshops about understanding the history of race and policy radicalization to violence, legal overview of hate, crimes and hate incidents, and extremism in gaming. The conference ended after a short presentation and a talkback session by the Aqua Pause troupe. Members presented three pieces in which the theme of being an ally was highlighted. In closing, here is Ms. Morozek on how all of us can be allies. Some of the things that Novi High School students can do to be allies for themselves, for others, for the community is to research and to really understand what's going on. You know, what are the issues? What's important to you? But what is important going on around you? Learning how to be an advocate means to have the right language and to understand what the needs are around you. So learn the language, do some research, and just ask people people. And if you want to get more involved in any of this work, you can come visit me in my room. I'm Miss Morozek in room 226, or Miss Spring, who is in room 220, and we'd love to talk to you. We have many clubs that represent important groups. Black Student Alliance, Chinese Korean Club, Dear Asian Youth, Gender and His Sexuality Alliance, Hispanic Latino Heritage, International Students Association, Japanese Club, Muslim Student Association, and more. Go to the meetings, be an ally. What's up, Wildcats? Do you want your story featured on the Cat's Eye News? Email us at nhscatseyenews at gmail.com. And that's the end of our first broadcast of this new season of CEN. We'll see you next week. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.